fancy here just me and my tripod uh, yeah some of you guys wanted me to do a walk around video so here it goes all right so I'll just start with the front here before I even bought the truck I bought this TRD Pro grill uh, I just think it looks a lot nicer than what was on there uh, I bought these eBay decals that are white that match the truck up front we got no front bumper yet i'm not sure what bumper i like or what i'm going to add and i'm also worried about adding more weight to the truck i did do a viper cut that you can see here i did that in my garage at home just to give myself more clearance and i actually really like how it looks if you notice i don't have any fog lights in my truck i just pulled out the baja designs fog lights because i'm going to be running dark defense lights on my truck i have teamed up with them and i'm excited to run their lights in the headlights here i have hid ddm tuning high beams the low beams are just leds from amazon moving to the side here i trimmed my fenders myself i took two inches off the fenders and that gives me more clearance for the 35 inch tires i'm running yokohama geolanders let's see what the exact size are they're 35 by 12 and a half by 17. i'm running relations race wheels these give me the options to run beadlocks later if i want these are the rr7s moving to suspension I'm running 2.5 Fox shocks all around. These have the adjustable reservoirs, which are nice because I can adjust the compression on the fly. Lower control arm, I'm running the Running for Tacos skids. The spindles are gusseted. I believe they're Total Chaos gussets. The lower control arms, let's see if I can show you guys. I have the Mar Marlin Crawler. Lower control arm gussets. Up top, I have the JD Fabrication. Upper control arm gussets, you can see here. I just wanted everything to be strong. The upper control arms are camberg. These are cool because you can max out the camber when you go get an alignment. And that gave me a little bit more clearance here for the tires that push the tires forward. All right, I am running a Midland MTX radio. I forget the exact model, but that is the Ghost Antenna. I do not have the TRD Pro. These are eBay specials, TRD Off-Road. I have the Meso LED turn signals here. These are black mirror covers that I added. Let's look under the hood. I'm running the engine, air intake, and not much else under here i'm running the sdhq battery terminals these make wiring clean everything's wired from the back there sorry my truck's dirty my wife and i just went camping um it's just about it i have these led utility lights also got from ebay but yeah you know another ebay special little TRD cap oh yeah a little TRD radiator cap I do want to replace these stock horns with the uh, hella super tones plan on doing this is for the HID kit that's the realize right there and oh I added these what are they redline tuning struts so my hood pops open by itself pretty nice I am running RCI sliders with the top plate in the back. 
have the Arca Garage shock relocate, the 12 inch Fox shocks, 2.5 diameter, also adjustable reservoir. I'm also running the hammer hangers with the cross member, as you can see there. Underneath, RCI rear diff skid. In the front, I just have the TRD Pro front skid plate. It's actually the Amazon knockoff. It's about half the price and it's steel and it does the job. Underneath the gas tank, I'm running Victory 4x4 skid. I have the transmission and transfer case skids in my garage. I took them off when I did the Oregon road trip and that saved me a hundred pounds, you know, to try to get some better gas match. Moving on to the back. I have the at the helm high clearance rear bumper. I absolutely love it. I installed it myself. I think it looks great. The swing out is awesome too, because I have a place for my spare tire. Running one Rotopax, so I think I might add another one. This is a two gallon. It'd be nice to have four gallons. You guys know what the back looks like. I have the custom build out from Squirrel Concepts. It may or may not be in the truck. It may be sitting in my garage. Let me just show you. So yeah, everything's pulled out. That's some trash that I picked up when I was camping. You can see here I built this base plate. We're gonna have a brand new build for the truck. I'm gonna build everything out of 8020 aluminum. It'll be a little lighter and I can customize it exactly how I want. So the build out is still for sale. If you're interested, send me a message on Instagram. What else is for sale? The camper shell, it's a Lear 100XR camper shell for sale you want it let me know the tent rooftop tent like new i just bought it used it three or four times it's a medium mount hood what's up neighbors for sale has a brand new mattress and also custom insulation job which i did myself you can watch a youtube video on it the cvt awning yes it did break the first time i used it but i did replace the hinges on it and it's functioning brand new, functioning well. Not much else to really cover. Um, the interior, I did do, whoa, I will show you the interior here. I have Clasio seat covers, Victory 4x4 Molly panels, and I have the Expedition Essentials 3T pan, which you can see I have my Midland radio on there, phone holder, and I have this ultra gauge, which I monitor my transmission temperatures with. All right, some other little things. I have these uh, Skyjacker seat mounts. These help my back a little bit, and they also help me see when I'm off-roading because it raised the seat, I think an inch in the front, maybe a half inch in the back. WeatherTech floor mats, WeatherTech rain guards, and... I got a sound system in here. Not that it really matters much. Everything's a mess because I don't have the storage build out. But we got kicker speakers, kicker tweeters. Then I got a 12 inch sub behind that seat in a Taco Tunes box. And I think that's it. It's gonna be a quick video. The truck is awesome. I didn't build this to wheel. I built this to go cool places and go camping so hope you guys enjoyed the video i don't think i'm missing much else but stay tuned in the next six months the truck is gonna get a transformation and i'm super excited once again if you want a rooftop tent at a great price send me a message awnings for sale camper shells for sale and my custom build out is sitting in the garage ready to be picked up and one last thing, I have these Rego bed supports. Pretty awesome. They help your bed from not flexing. All right. Well, that is it. Hope you enjoyed the video. And go hit some cool trails.
see you guys